Alright, hold up, hold up. <laughs> I like the shirt. It was just gonna keep on going and going. What is this though? This is what I'm taking a Mustang. Is this the new the new whip? You got JDM on us? Yeah. Alright, let's go. Let's tell them what we got going on today, man. I'm not gonna lie though, this would be an awesome addition to my little fleet as a daily. Can we make that happen or not? <laughs> you got brand new? Very exciting things going down today as we speak. Jordan, oh. where are we heading? We're heading to Franklin, Virginia. We're heading to Franklin, Virginia today to go pick up Mr. Ruby 50 himself. Um, he got some work done, huh? A little bit. Some exciting work done. So you guys are gonna see that first hit here in today's video. But before we go any further, you gotta do your boy a huge favor. Drop a like up on this video. I literally talked to the YouTube team. They told me that each like and each comment truly, truly significantly helps the video's ranking and getting pushed out to new people. So if you support your boy, take a second, drop a like up on the video, guys. It truly means a ton. And uh, today's gonna be juicy, juicy, juicy. Big, big video. We got some stuff painted, some new parts added. It's going for a paint correction in like a week? No, not, not even, even. a couple days. It's gonna be sick. I'm excited to see it, but we do have an hour and a half drive on the way there. And you just saw we are taking Jordan's new daily, this Honda Civic, which I, I do kind of want. I'm not gonna lie to it's you. It's nice, it, it really is, it really is. And it's blue too, four door. Hit <laughs> VTech real quick. Hold on, give me a second. There it is. Oh, it's boost, dude. <laughs> like nitrous. I was in such a high gear for that. <laughs> What's up? Man? What's oh, going on? Oh, no. Bro, how are you doing this? What do you mean? With that helmet on. You like that? It is so <laughs> hot. Jordan and I were wondering, mm -hmm. what the fuck do y'all do out here? Oh, street race. Is that like the entertainment out here? Because there is <laughs> nothing, dude. Nothing. That and, uh, that's all I do. <laughs> we made it. Let's get it, man. Let's see how she looks. I can get out of this door. You excited? Excited. Oh, there she is. What a new look. It needed Can't wait that. To put the lip on, dog. Yeah, it needed that, but that looks so sick, dude. That turned out awesome. Obviously, you can tell there's a couple things that are different. The main one being the hood, which started out as a Grabber Blue Hood, believe it or not. Um, but you know, your boy, uh, he did his magic, made it look good. Um, I asked if he could paint this gloss black um, just because I wanted it to match a couple things that are already gloss black on the car. Um, and obviously we had to change up the fogs, get the front end looking a little different, no more front plate. Uh, Those fogs look familiar, man. <laughs> Roush look familiar. fogs, man. I guess the other stuff is on the rear to check out there. But yeah, hood, repainted the whole front bumper. We had some, you know, rock chips, some scuffs and all that. So he fixed everything up. Uh, and then we come back here. So we got the GT500 wing put on, repainted the whole trunk um, just so that we could get everything looking right because uh, when you take the old wing off there was some messed up paint underneath of it so couldn't be rocking that. Dude you've had this wing for like two or three years. I've, I've had this in my garage for two years. That's crazy. Yeah. But dude let's focus on this front end real quick. What a freaking difference. One more thing that we're adding to the front not many people have done. 
I'm just gonna leave it at that. Um, you'll probably see it in this video, but we're gonna surprise you with it. And when we pull it off, it's honestly gonna be the most unique S197 front end because it's just that no one runs this setup that we're about to do on it. It's crazy though, dude, what a difference. This looks sick. It looks good. It needed it, it truly it did. The front did. plate yeah. alone, just getting rid of that, it, it just cleaned up so well. The hood's nice because it has that stock effect, but it's honestly, you know, it has a GT500 heat extractor. Yeah. So that's sick. I love that in gloss too, that was a must. So one through 10, how hard of a job was this Ruby Red yeah. all in all? Um, it's honestly just part of the job, really. Mm -hmm. um, Ruby Red can be a pain in the ass to start with. These are the cards that I had to do to get it to match, and I'll show you the one that I actually, see I write notes on the back of it to let me know what I need to do. But what I did do, this is the actual one I sprayed your car, what I did. Nice. It's three coats of base, two co or three coats of candy. I used a darker, more vivid, or more vivid, darker flop. So, and this is what the actual color ended up being. This is usually what it starts out as. Look how too deep it oh is. Oh my yeah. God. That's uh, two coats of candy. That's three coats. So I was like, sh**. Okay. <laughs> That's yep. one, two, three, and four coats on each one of them. So I had to do that to try to figure out how many coats of candy it actually needed. Guys, what do you think? Ruby 2.0, and again, it's not finished. We have one more major thing to add to the front end to truly bring the whole appearance full circle. But if you dig it, drop a like up on this video, guys. Show him some support, run it up, and uh, you're gonna see this thing at Mustang Week, man. There's a couple things it's doing before we leave, and it's gonna be sick, but turned out so good. We got some we got more goodies. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta check these out. They're going on soon. Wow. Oh, baby. Oh yeah, dude. They're gonna look sick. Mm. The covers can finally go. Thank the Lord. For the people in the area, what's your contact info if you, they want to get some side work done? Yeah, I'm kind of doing picking and choosing right now okay. because uh, I'm in the middle of doing the garage thing. I gotcha. So I'm kind of, I honestly didn't, almost didn't take on this job, but I was like, f*** it, I'll do it because I ain't got nothing else going on. Hit me up on Facebook, uh, Cliff Hatcher, or on Instagram, um, it's Cliff underscore hatcher with a three instead of e want to reach out to him see what you're working with and see if he can fit you in it's gonna look so good with that lip on there yeah. it really is it's gonna be just so different looking uh oh deke bean behind the wheel of a civic We have day two of working on Ruby 2.0. Jordan, you wanna go ahead and give us a rundown of what we got going on today? We're putting the front lip on. What front lip though? The front lip. All right, dude, hey listen. So like, these guys don't know what the fuck you're talking about. They need some context. Okay, you ready? We're gonna try that again. <clears throat> what front lip? The one that goes in the car. Over there, bro, you wanna look at it? Tag lights lit. We do have part of Lucifer's old GT500 bottom lip. Go ahead, give them a little dry mock up real quick. It's gonna take some fabbing, some modification, but that is gonna look so freaking sick. Break your lungs loose. Give her the wheel lock. Yeah. Here, give me the wheel lock, I'll do that. Are you putting that one on? Huh? You put that one on? Yeah, we're gonna, he's gonna see how he likes the fins on the bottom. What the f***? What was that noise? We have a visitor that just came by. You guys saw this car about two weeks ago. This is Chase's, gotta have it green. He just got done doing a full single turbo setup, a whole motor swap, um, forged internals, a trans, he did a whole nine on this thing. And it's here. So that means it's driving. It's alive. How's it, how's it doing overall? Doing pretty good, pretty good. Just gonna get the tune dialed in, 
get the 1300s in it. And, uh, and party. <laughs> <laughs> Start her up. Let's hear this thing. That's going to be loud. No, 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 not here. I'm trying to go to sleep tonight in my apartment. Little update on the lip install. We're trucking away. Um, 2013, 2014 Shelby GT500 uh, bottom valance. So what we had to do was Dremel off a lot of the tabs. And it's honestly a very, very easy fit. It's just, you know, you have to drill some yourself. You have to cut some stuff with a Dremel. We got hardware underneath. That's all mounted up. And this car is looking freaking sick, man. This front end transformation on Ruby 2.0 is just fire. We're finishing up mounting with the two front bolts. And then after that, it's pretty much done. We can lower the car after putting the wheels and stuff back on. Get the first look with it on the ground. I think it's gonna look sick. And um, you know, now he has the option if he ever wants to run the GT500 bottom lip, which this one is my old one. It's kind of beat up, so we're gonna pass on those today. But as soon as we set this down, you'll see why, because it, it honestly looks great. Dude, it looks insane. It drops it, breaks it yeah, shut. It <laughs> Smacks against the floor. Oh yeah. Bruh. Oh yeah. What? Oh yeah. What? Oh yeah. Dude. Uh, it's, it's, it's insane. I it's insane, dude. Fine. Let's take a look. I'm let's impressed. Take a look. Let's take a look. Woo! <laughs> That's fire. Dude, that, that lip. Oh my God, why does it look so good? Dude, I miss my fogs. Remember I was telling you about that the yeah. other day? I was like, I low key want to get them back. With the lower lip, dude, that thing be scraping. When I was piecing it all together, I was like, you know, will it look good? And I was like, I think so, but I wasn't sure. It's, uh, honestly, this is one of the best stock 13, 14 front ends I've seen. The color too. That's Ruby 2.0 right there. Mustang week 2021 prep. Ted, how's your car going? Yours all dialed in, right? Ted's is ready. Jordan has it's like one done. more thing, just the Bremos, roof wraps and stuff and whatnot. Yep, yeah, and I'm actually about to head and go get Blucifer. Um, it was been gone for about three or four days, getting a two-step um, two paint correction with a double ceramic interior, exterior. Like, I'm very excited. So we're gonna go pick that up. So with the car's new look and stuff, you actually have some merch dropping at Mustang week, right? Yeah. I do. How many shirts and, you got? Uh, I've got 100 shirts. 100 shirts, okay, and how much? 20 yeah, bucks? 20 bucks. Me, Jordan, Jake, we're all gonna have our merch there. Come find us, and uh, I'm sure I'm sure you'll be seeing this thing, so. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you tomorrow, 8 p.m. Eastern time. I, I hope um, it's Mustang week, prep week, and then we're gone, so I'm gonna try my best to have all the videos out this week, but shout out, Fox Body, I almost said Project Fox, but until next time, we'll see you later.